when my waist get like this y'all ain't gonna be able to tell me nothing okay yeah get into the body <laughs> and i know they better not ask me to come no more like no i'm not coming <laughs> i'm outside in a damn jeep right outside tt two turn baby girl you know me still with the dolls that i grew beside all the niggas brown my channel today's video as you can see from the title it is going to be part of my living alone weekly vlog series so today is sunday <clears throat> january 28th 3 47 in the evening i just woke up i just worked so i'm not posting a video today because i didn't even get a chance to freaking edit it girl for y'all because i worked this past friday and saturday and my patience was hell <laughs> so i could not do anything other than tend to my patience so if you're new here hey girl my name is akira janae don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave so today it is like i said it's 348 i need to go to target real bad we gotta go to target we gotta restock on some hygiene items i need trash bags um i need to what else i gotta pick up like three packages from my um amazon hub locker thingy here i need to also go to sephora i did a pickup order like I think I did it Friday, but since I worked Friday and Saturday, I didn't even go. And Sephora holds your stuff for five days, they said. So I'm just going to go ahead. I'm just going to go ahead and go get that. I almost ripped out my belly button here since. So that's what we're going to do right now. Um, and then I'll probably come back and cook. I ate my meal prep, my chicken, roast potatoes, and macaroni this morning when I got off work because I was starving. I did something a little bit heavier than my freaking breakfast and we'll probably go ahead and cook those ribs tonight because i just need a good home cooked meal and i ain't had no barbecue in a minute like i want barbecue ribs barbecue baked beans that mac and cheese and i need it all touching okay i'm definitely one of them but i did just get this package delivered to my apartment so i'm gonna go ahead and open it i already know what's in it um and i want to actually use it right now so thank you so much dossier for sponsoring this portion of the video i have four beautiful perfumes to show you guys if you don't know who dossier is you must be living under the rock because girl their perfumes are so good this one is like i said i picked up four this one is floral honeysuckle um inspired by the gucci bloom mm, i smelled that before as well <clears throat> not too long ago so this is how it looks i just love their packaging really cute simple straight to the point nothing too much yes mm. i smelled the gucci one sometime last year like maybe like in november yes i like that oh yes i like the day here's the card if you guys want to pause and read about it i sprayed it but okay i'm gonna rank them like i'm gonna rank them so y'all guys so you can know which one is my favorite so that one i really like i'm gonna put that one I'm going to put that one as number two right now because I already know what my number one is. I accidentally ordered one that I already had and obviously I know how it smells. And that one is the one that like I literally wear every single day. The second one that I got is called um, Powdery Orange Flower. It's inspired by the Valentino. Ooh, I don't even think I actually <clears throat> smell. I think I smelled the Valentino, but I honestly don't remember how it smells. Okay, now I see why the girl needs to be having Valentino. I want to say I smelled this before, but not knowing that it was like the Valentino scent. I like that. I like that a lot. And Prince is right here trying to smell as well. Mmm. <laughs> okay. I think powdery orange flower is going to go to number two. And then the Gucci Bloom inspired one, the Floral Honeysuckle will be number three. Um, we're gonna go ahead and talk about my number one, which is Floral Violet, because I just know this is my number one. This one is inspired by the Marc Jacobs Daisy. You can pause to read. Girl, this one, no, is this my favorite one? Let me see. One of these is, 
it's either floral violet or floral lavender that's my favorite i don't know okay no this one is not my favorite smells obviously amazing but this is not the one that i always wear so it's not the mark jacobs inspired one mm, it smells so good though the top notes is watermelon um strawberry and pa pomelo mm, that definitely smells good but that's not that's not my signature that i like to wear okay floral violet uh, i don't know Okay, I'm gonna put floral honeysuckle in number four. Floral violet will be number three. And the, okay, yeah, okay. I think this is my number one. So this is floral lavender. It's, yes, inspired by YSL Libre. Oh my gosh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, let me, I, I just know this my scent, I just know. Mm, yes, oh my gosh. Yes, 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 a thousand times yes. This is my signature freaking scent. Mm, it just smells so good and I really love, oh, I just love this so much. This is what it looks like. Oh my gosh, so I'm about to put this on right now. Okay, so floral lavender is definitely my first pick. It smells the best in my personal opinion. And then the one inspired by the Valentino is called the Powdery Orange Flower. That's definitely number two. Number three is Floral Violet inspired by the Marc Jacobs Daisy. And then coming in fourth place, smells amazing as well, but <clears throat> it's the Gucci Bloom. Floral Honeysuckle is the name on their website. And this is coming in fourth place. So I'm going to go ahead and put on my little perfume combo like i said i absolutely love this floral lavender inspired by the ysl libre so i like to put this on right here what is that and before i spray it right here i've been using this vanilla bean fragrance oil i love this combination this combination i swear is top tier like you will not be disappointed sis this i get this from amazon so i will have that link down below it's like five or six dollars maybe but this is the key you need to put that oil on and then spray this over and i promise you like literally last night i had two people that was just like kind of sitting close by me and they was just like you smell so good and i was like thank you thank you thank you and y'all know they always tell me that i smell good every time i wear i'm i'm telling y'all Obviously, scents smell different on everybody. I had saw that on like TikTok. People was talking about like, stop telling everybody, uh, you know, we're like, I don't care. But definitely find the scent that's right for you. And I just think this just smells so amazing on me per se. So yeah, I've been talking for almost 10 minutes. We're about to go ahead and head out. Um, I need to switch my camera to this mini tripod right here. And we're gonna go ahead and go to, I'm gonna stop and get my packages first just so I don't forget it when I come back home i'm gonna stop and get my packages first and it is sunday so let me see what time sephora closed on sunday <laughs> because that may have to just be my first stop okay yeah they close at six and it's already about to be four o'clock and i don't want to get in target and be in there for a long while so i'm going to go ahead and go to sephora first when we leave about it here working on a weekend like usual way off in the deep end like usual Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hit the block up, I tell you if it was us Man, a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush Say my day's a number, but I keep waking up No, you see my text, baby, please say something Wine by the glass, man, a cheapskate hum Niggas gotta move on my release day, huh? Bitch, this is fame, not clout I don't even know what that's about Watch your mouth Maybe got an ego twice the size of the crib I can never tell the shit it is what it is Said what I had to and did what I did Never turn my back on every G, God forbid Heard you got the paddock on my wrist Doing front flips Giving you my number but don't hit me on no dumb shit Working on the weekend like usual Way off in the deep end like usual Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up 
Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping once, okay, so what? Someone hit the block up, I tell you if it was us. Man, a house in Rosewood, this shit too plush. It's cool, man. Got red bottles on. Life is good. <laughs> So I'm back home. It is 6.58 in the evening. Um, it's dark now. We went to Sephora. We went to Target. I was in Ulta when I was in actual Target. Um, what else did I do? Oh, I went and got my toes done. <laughs> I literally was just like, get, 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 give it, go. <laughs> so I went and got my toes done because girl, I just thought about it. I'm like, I ain't had my toes done since like November. And I just really wanted my toes done. Like, baby, white toes for the, yeah, you know the rest. <laughs> but my feet look so good. She massaged my feet. I got the deluxe package. She massaged my feet so good. Toes look good. They just feel so good. Like, she did an excellent job with the deluxe package. So, she got a real nice tip. That was about like, they're fairly cheap as well. Like, that whole... I think I paid like maybe $80 and that was with tips. So it was really nice. I'm not doing my nails. Y'all know I decided to start doing my nails every 1st and 15th of the month. So I'm going to go on the 1st and get a whole new set. I think I want to try almond shaped nails or like oval. My friend Janae, y'all know her. She's been on the vlog a few times. She just got almond nails and she's really loving them. and They look really cute on her. So I want to try that out. So, so we're going to do a little haul. We're going to get into... We're gonna save Tarjay for last. It's funny that somebody just commented and said they want me to do, um, what y'all say? Like hygiene stuff, beauty stuff, perfume haul, all of that. Baby, I got you in this whole video, okay? So obviously from Target, I got this big old thing of um, paper towels, so we're just gonna put that to the side. <laughs> we're gonna start off with Sephora. I actually had a pickup order with them. Um, I wanted to try out, I think I was telling y'all that I wanted to try out a brow pencil. So, I mean, I just got the Benefit Brow Pencil. Um, this is like the small one. So it says 12 hour wear waterproof. Um, I'll tell y'all how I like it. I haven't had a brow pencil in a minute. I usually just go to the beauty supply store. I got it in warm brown, number five. I usually go to the beauty supply store and literally just pick up any brow pencil there. So this is going to be new for me, but I saw a lot of people rave about this one in it i thought it was really cute so i just decided to get this one i'll probably try it out tomorrow maybe tonight i do need to do a she in haul so we'll see if i want to actually do that or not tonight because i do need to edit <clears throat> this weekly vlog for y'all to post tomorrow so other thing i got from sephora is the ordinary brand um girl i think i ordered the wrong stuff i thought is this the cleansing wash um, I thought I ordered the Ordinary Facial Cleanser, but this is what I got. So I'm gonna use it. I mean, I like the Ordinary brand. I already used two of their products anyway, so I'm just gonna use this. But dang, I wish I would've looked at this then in the car because I would've just bought it out of Target. Target sells it as well. I really, I, well, I wanted the facial cleanser. So I guess I'll go pick that up tomorrow, but we got this, I guess some brightening formula. 
And then I got something else that I cannot show. Y'all see that a little bit later. And my Amazon packages, I got it from Amazon as well. First off, why did they send my stuff like this? Because why is everybody in my business? I hate when Amazon suppliers send stuff in the actual just package like this to where everybody can see because anybody can easily open this, take my stuff out and look at it. I don't like that. Anyways, I got a two pack of medium size shirts. I wanna wear these for when I go work out. Um, they have some really good reviews on there. A few of them were bad, but I mean, to me, it just looks like a really good shirt. And plus it's kind of like that spandex, stretchy, kind of dry fit material. And I noticed that when I've been going to the gym, I literally have maybe at least 25, 15 to 25 pairs of like workout shorts and workout leggings. I just bought those three, three, four. I probably got like six or seven workout leggings. I have no shirts. I have some sports bras, but I'm not comfortable enough to like wear sports bras to the gym. Like the girlies that do it cool, but like that's just not my cup of tea. So I would rather just wear a sports bra and then have a shirt over it. So I got it in blue and then I got it in black. I feel like these are two basic colors that would just go with everything. So if I actually really like these, how they fit when I go to the gym tomorrow, uh, I'll probably put in another order to order like four more. So yeah, just got these two shirts. They'll be linked to my Amazon storefront under clothes beauty one of those probably clothing items Even to my tarjay haul you guys already basically saw what i was putting into my car so this is going to be really fast um the eos body lotion been seeing all the tiktok girlies and everybody rave about this one the only one that i actually liked was the vanilla the only one that i actually like the smell of is the vanilla cashmere the pomegranate one stinks real bad and then the other one stinks as well to me this is the only one that smells good. Um, the Promegrant, I would never wear that one, but they had another one. I would maybe wear that, but it's not something that I would buy. Like I would, if someone was to gift it to me, then I would wear it. But this one smells amazing. So can't wait to put that on tonight when I get out the shower. Other thing I got is just some foam and wrap lotion. I needed some for when I do my edges. You can see I need to do my edges again. So needed some more of this. It says with apple cider and vinegar oil for wigs, braids, weaves, and locks. Yeah, so I just got it for my <coughs> slow ends. Needed some new razors. This is my favorite brand of razors that I like to get. Um, I always just buy the three packs. Sometimes I buy either the five or the six packs. So these are really, really good razors. And they're not too expensive. Y'all know I've been talking about getting some more trash bags. I really like this brand from Target. Like their brand, just a lavender scent, 13 gallon bags. It comes with 50. These really last me a very, very long time. So definitely recommend getting those. And we're gonna get into my vitamins and supplements and stuff. Well, here. Also wanted some more, um, I needed some more like body oil. So I really like this Vaseline brand, body oil. Love this down. I just wish it was bigger because I feel like this only lasts maybe about a month because I literally use it daily. My favorite mouthwash, this is the only one that I've tried. Um, I know they got the pink bottle and like a turquoise bottle, but if I like something, I'm just gonna stick with it. I don't really wanna be switching around trying stuff, but this is my favorite mouthwash ever. And obviously I feel like it's the best mouthwash because the pH balance on that is immaculate. Needed some more body wash. I like the Dove body wash. I get deep moisture, I get the shea butter, I get sensitive skin. All of them are fine for me. I don't break out or anything. And then this is new. Um, the pomegranate seeds and shea butter, hilarious because I said I didn't like the pomegranate smell in this one. <laughs> but the Dove one actually smells good, probably because it has shea butter mixed in it and the pomegranate EOS had something that did not smell good mixed with it, so. This one smells amazing. The consistency looks really nice. Y'all know I already got the actual shea butter one in there as well. So, absolutely love that. And I love this EOS brand of shaving cream. I like this bottle better than the actual, like I like the squeeze tube better than the one you like press down on because I feel like you get more of your product with this one. And I just like the way it comes out a little bit better. It's, it kind of comes out like lotion, but it's like really, really nice. And it's thick, so a little goes a long way. So this is my favorite shaving cream ever, and it literally leaves you silky soft. Um, I'm kind of getting low on my toothpaste. The one I like is the Colgate Outfit White Mint Free Toothpaste. And now we're gonna get into my um supplements. I needed some more Elf Primer. This is the dupe for the uh, Milk Hydro Primer. Absolutely love. Definitely the best primer that I've ever used. My makeup looks amazing every time I use that. Now, getting into my supplements, I did 
re-up on these because girl i didn't have any more vitamins left i love the ollie brand me and ollie go together real bad so i like to get the probiotics and prebiotics 30 count i take this daily you only need one of these is along with the ollie brand women multivitamins it has vitamin a c d e and b really really nice i love this brand i love these multivitamins and y'all know i also take vitamin d by itself that's the nature's made brand or whatever i get that from like walmart or somewhere but just for a multivitamin i like this and then the actual vitamin d i do take that separately as well um i like this brand for the apple cider vinegar gummies i used to take these a lot last year and then when i ran out i just never really bought bought it again but actually really do like the product um especially with me doing this like two week uh challenge and stuff i feel like it'd be really nice for my uh stomach good health and all of that so i've been seeing bloom around so much on tiktok everybody uses it i wanted to try it out really bad this is like the smaller version of it i believe because i think it comes in a bigger bottle but i just decided to get the strawberry kiwi flavor for digestion bloating and energy it says 25 servings so the calories is is 20 calories fiber like all so of that so i have found this girl on tiktok this is her and she's taking the l glutamine and also the bloom as well to help with her bloating and stuff like that and she is liking them um she says she don't recommend taking them together because obviously the instructions tell you what to do so the back of this one says take with water i personally mix this with cranberry juice because i cannot drink it with water um and this one this one does say that you can um add one scoop to eight to twelve fluid ounces of cold water juice or a smoothie and mix it well so i'll probably just add i'll probably try it by itself with water since it's actually kiwi strawberry like i'll do like a little sample test like mix just a little bit in there and then if i can actually drink it with water i'll drink this one straight with water um if not we're just gonna throw this in some juice as well okay or a smoothie and this one i see people do smoothies as well i just do a little like six or ten ounce of cranberry apple i cannot mix it with anything else but cranberry apple right now because the apple was so sour that like you can't even just this is flavorless like it's literally unflavored but unflavored stuff to me still got a flavor you know like and you can just kind of feel the particles of the powder i don't know so i like to mix it with cranberry apple because the apple is so sour Cran regular cranberry is as well but anyways th th this one i'm about to be taking together well not together but you know um the girlies in her comments are saying really, really good things and saying that, saying that they have really, really good results and stuff. So I'm super excited. This one and my creatine, I normally take every day. I didn't take it today because I was asleep, but I'm going to um, take it again tomorrow. I did miss a day and then I'm going to start this tomorrow as well. So I'm excited to see how my little two weeks go and <clears throat> I'm going to do it before and after as well. I'm doing the Chloe Ting two week ab shred challenge if you want to know. But yeah, that's all my haul. I also bought some edge control. Um, this is from Kiss. I never use their edge control. I usually use 24 hour edge tamer or whatever. This one's really cute and it's sweet peach and it smells amazing. Like real good. Oh girl, I'm not even done with my Carjay haul. <laughs> okay, so I saw these when I was in the aisle for my paper towels, these are $5. So I believe these, these were right at the front. It's just a glass pump bottle. Um, I needed some more of these because I'm gonna put these for my like laundry items. Yeah, I'm excited. The ones I got now is the ones that like the drink holders that you just lift up and it comes out. That's kind of messing up. So I would much rather pump it out instead of using, you know, the other one. So I bought two. Um, I really could have just got away with one because I really just want it for fabric softeners. So I don't know, we'll see. I'll probably take one back or I'll just keep both of them. And as well as this was up there at the front, these were only $5. They had the rectangle ones and they had square. These are for your um, tissues. I absolutely love this. How stinking cute is this? It just pulls out like a drawer and then you just put your stuff in here. Y'all know I got this one from Shein. 
um but this one i'll probably keep this in my bedroom because the box that i have on my bed isn't cute it's not aesthetically pleasing so i want it to be cute so i'm gonna put the tissues in here that's in there on my bed and the last thing i got is this garnier fructis anti-frizz serum i absolutely love this brand i used to use this all the time this is like a major throwback for me i used to use this all the time in high school i like this a lot for like sew-ins and weave and since i'm wearing virgin hair now instead of raw hair um i needed something a little bit lighter on the hair so this serum is a lot thinner than the aussie brand that i use the aussie brand is really really thick it's a thick ass oil actually <laughs> so this one is definitely a lot um like thinner so I, I think this is really good for like thinner hair lighter hair instead of like african-american hair like i like to use the aussie brand for like my actual real hair so yeah i got this that's all my camera's overheating i'm about to put up my stuff and then i'm about to let my camera kind of cool off a little bit once i put all this stuff up and put it um once I put all this stuff up, I'll come back and we actually about to cook some barbecue ribs. It's only seven o'clock. I'll probably be eating by like 8.39, which is cool. I'm going to be up anyway because I do got to edit this vlog for y'all. So today is Monday, the 29th, 448. I actually gotta go to work today. So not gonna be vlogging today and tomorrow, which will be Tuesday. I am uploading a vlog right now. It's at 52 minutes. And I needed to clean my charm bracelet and my actual bracelet from Sissy's Log Cabin. So I have it right here in just some water and Dawn dish soap. I wanted to kind of show y'all how dirty this thing was i can get it it's like really dirty even though i like shower with it and stuff like that i don't ever take it off i'm not that type of girl i just always keep it on so definitely the class the class <laughs> on the pandora bracelet definitely had a lot of like dirt and stuff in there so yeah you can see that big chunk right there so just push it out a little bit clean it up and then I'm gonna take it out and we're gonna dry it off with the cloth. So yeah, I just literally decided to take it off and saw that dirt in there. And yeah, girl, we have to clean her up. <laughs> So I actually have a spoolie for like eyelashes. Um, I used to sell eyelashes. That was like kind of my first business. So now looking back watching these clips, I'm like, girl, I got a whole like 50, 100 pack of disposable like little spoolies. And I literally could have used that to really get up in the nooks and the crannies of this um, little heart Pandora class, whatever. But it's cool. I'll do it next time I decide to clean it. Hey 
y'all update it's 5 38 um i'm gonna leave out for work at exactly six o'clock i just took down my hair out of my little heatless little flexi ride roller thingy or whatever put on a little lip gloss and got on my scrubs these are the scrubs that janae sells um my friend janae who's been on here she has a scrub business i got a hair business her um, website and stuff i had linked it in my other vlog but it's shop june's designs i believe i'll link it again below um really cute love them and yeah i'm wearing these today from her um hair is cute like i said the uh what is it the little foam and wrap lotion i really like i put a little bit of got to be glue free spray on there um i may put a little bit more i think i want to go to the store and actually buy some like pump it up spritz spray because i used to love that growing up and it really does the job instead of using like the got to be glue free spray and i have not curled my hair since that clip last week um what i got my hair done last what monday tuesday no last wednesday and then i had curled my hair that same day i believe to um because the rain had messed it up and this is just the curls from then and me wrapping it in that little bitty heatless little curler thing whatever so yeah about to take prints out my video has two minutes left and then it has the process in like 4k i believe so it's 5 40 we got about 20 more minutes before i have to leave the house so hopefully it'll be done if not i'm just gonna save it on there and then i'll do the finishing touches from my phone so just wanted to check in a little bit again because like i said i'm not gonna be vlogging for the next two days because i'm gonna be at work and i will talk to y'all again probably it's monday i probably talk to y'all again wednesday unless if i wake up and decide to actually really do something tomorrow which probably not besides my little two week uh ab challenge workout which is about it oh i made this as well so y'all know I got calendars and stuff all around my apartment. So this specific calendar is the one that I used to use for my bills like so I can see when my stuff is due. But I'm about to actually do what I used to do when I moved out in like 2020. Um, I put my bill date in my calendar so that obviously my phone is always in my hand so then I can see it that way so I don't forget. So that's what I'm gonna start doing. This one I decided to do for my workout and my meal plan. Well, my workouts and my meal plan. So right here you see on the 9th, my two week ab challenge will be done. Today is the 29th, I crossed it out cause I already did it. I started last Friday. So we don't got that many days left. I'm trying to stay consistent. I've tried this Chloe Ting workout two week challenge probably about three or four times and never completed it i'm about to complete that literally this year so we're gonna do that see how i look after that and then i'm about to be out for another like eight or nine days and then i'm gonna get into the gym i want to go to the actual gym at least three times a week if more kudos to me but i at least need to be in there three times a week so i got my little meal prep as well y'all know i cooked ribs and stuff last night so i left my lunch box at my job <laughs> Uh, Saturday so hopefully they didn't throw my crap out but I just put it in this bag because my big lunchbox is still at work so I got me a Sprite water and then this is my ribs mac and cheese you know what I cooked last night and then I'm just gonna put my container into my um big lunchbox that I got at work he's ready to be taken out so I'm about to go ahead and take him out take this little bit of trash out and yeah I'll talk to y'all for sure Wednesday so yeah bye hey y'all today is thursday february 1st happy black history month period okay it is 4 53 in the evening um they just left and i just took prints on a <clears throat> kind of a long walk a longer walk than what i normally be taking him on because i'm just in a good mood today so we just took a long walk um I haven't talked to y'all in a few days so last night he had came yesterday i was supposed to wake up and like just clean my entire apartment so that today i could actually you know really get to record some stuff i got a little she and tiktok that i need to do and kind of just plan out my content for february is what i had planned to like do today because y'all know i say it all the time i cannot think and cooperate in mess like in a messy apartment you know nothing like that so that's what i'm gonna redo today we had went and looked at a few apartments um for him to move up here closer to me um 
So yeah, I'll probably pop those in right now. So these are separate from that? Or right. any other charges you have? Right. Um, so water, trash, and sewage is from us. Okay. Uh, that's one bill. Um, electricity will set up an account with Entergy and pay them directly. I and then for internet, you can use AT&T or Xfinity. And okay. that all depends on your practices with that. Okay, and you said the utilities are separate? Yeah, they're all separate. Okay. And you're responsible for all of them outside of the village, right? Okay, right. Um, okay. Okay. Did you have any pets come with you or anything? Huh? Have you any pets? No. No, no, no. He has a pet, but no. <laughs> <laughs> at least not right now. I don't know. I may give him a book or something. <laughs> nice. okay. I so love this. Moment spacious. Put my, like, little cloak, put my little rack right here. A whole couch? Yeah. Come on now. Like this, is, yeah. this is. Oh my gosh. I'm moving. <laughs> No, this is nice. You're gonna have a lot of space. Look at this. Like, this is bigger than my closet. Very nice. I need the space. I need the space too. The closet. I'm about to. Stuff. Honey, my sink right here. Do you claim it already? Period. You claim it already. A shower. And after the um, apartment tours that we went on, we went to two different places, but the first place showed us like four different like layouts. So we did that, got back. We um, was just in here talking for hours and stuff. Um, my stomach is actually growling right now. I did eat Chick-fil-A breakfast, but I am hungry right now. I have um, some food that I cooked last night, like the little, my meal prep basically, I got that left over. Um, and I started to waist train today. I do got to do my little, um, Chloe Ting two week ab workout today, but I got my waist trainer on. I put her on at like 11 o'clock and let's just, let's just move y'all back because first off, when my waist get like this, y'all ain't gonna be able to tell me nothing. Okay. Get into it. Get into the body. Yeah. Get into the body. Yeah. Get into the body. <laughs> But I'm just like, girl, when my waist actually just kind of just swoop, y'all ain't gonna be able to tell me nothing. So that's why I'm working hard right now because when summer hit, baby, I'm about to be in the bikinis. I'm about, I'm about to be in everything that I want to be in, okay? So it's just kind of hard with trying to lose the stomach fat or a little bit of fat that I do got well as as well as like gaining weight and trying to like maintain it. So it's just a whole ordeal. So I've been kind of struggling with that because it's like, girl, you need to eat this much to gain weight, but it's like, I need to be eating right. You know, like not no junk food, not no sugar, none of that. I need to be doing a clean bulk basically. So that's what I'm gonna try to fill out today and try to figure out what exactly foods that I wanna get for a clean bulk because you know, Obviously, yeah, I'm gonna gain the weight, but baby, I want it to go in the right places and I don't want it looking bad. So, with the weight I got now, I'm just trying to, you know, waist train, do my little ad workouts, throw those in just to do a little bit better day by day. So, I've been waist training though since 11 o'clock this morning and it's about to be five o'clock. So, I think I really wanna do maybe like eight to 10 hours, like not too much, but this is the only time that this waist trainer has not like, been hurting me like it doesn't itch it doesn't like nothing it's in my amazon storefront as well if you want it but yeah i've been doing really good today so what i'm about to do for the rest of today is literally just clean what i was supposed to do last night um i did already wash my bedding so it's in the dryer that should be done i washed my um bathroom mats I actually mopped my bathroom floor, but I do need to clean out my shower. So we're just gonna do a little bit of mini little deep clean um, so that I can get my life together starting tomorrow <laughs> with my posting schedules and figure out my meals and stuff because I'm off until next Friday. So I got a lot of off days, girl. But next week, we'll be starting a new weekly vlog. And like, you know, next week is my boyfriend's birthday. So like, I got some stuff planned for that. We're gonna be doing up like, next week is gonna be very exciting. <laughs> and then the week after that, it's gonna be Valentine's Day. So yeah it's Liddy over here but i'm gonna stop talking because i've been talking for a little while oh i forgot to show y'all also he had brought this to ask me to be his valentine so obviously i'm not gonna open it because you know that's personal but 
he wrote a little note as soon as it's valentine got my favorite wine what's funny is this says i love you to the moon and back this is something that he's been saying to me since forever like when i'd be like how much you love me he always say to the moon and back so got that and then the reese's chocolates um that he got me a candle favorite water and then he also got me these sour patches oh i wanted to show y'all this too so for the ones that care and be asking about my weight gain journey and stuff like that and just want tips or whatever i'm about to try out this new protein um called ghost comment down below if you guys have tried this out but ghost have samples um most protein companies usually have to where you can buy a sample and the ones that do thank you because it's a lifesaver so i got the chip ahoy and then i got the oreo i want to mix this with vanilla almond milk is why i haven't tried it yet because i only have like two percent milk and i if i do gotta drink milk i'm not a milk drinker i can't just drink milk it's disgusting but if i do have to drink milk it has to be vanilla almond milk so i'm gonna go get some of that to mix this in here and we're gonna try this out tomorrow but yeah i'm super excited um i have not tried the bloom yet i'm gonna do all of this tomorrow like i said i wanted to start today february but i haven't taken my creatine i've been taking my l glutamine like all my daily vitamins all of that so we're gonna start like fresh fresh tomorrow with going to the gym i wake up go to the gym in the morning probably like eight o'clock nine o'clock and then when i get back from the gym we're gonna try this out i'm gonna stop and get some almond milk you know it's, it's gonna be real fun i may end up taking y'all with me to the gym this time just because I don't know. Like, I may I may take y'all to the gym. I may, instead of trying to record on my phone. We'll see, we'll see. But tomorrow gonna be leg day because I haven't had a leg day in a minute. I've been focusing on upper body. I've been focusing on upper body and abs. So, yeah. We're gonna get my apartment cleaned and squared away. kitchen and living room is clean and i mopped and swept the floors and stuff like that so it's smelling really good in here only thing is that's for a collaboration so we're gonna worry about that tomorrow i do gotta um do my bedroom and my bathroom but i usually neglect my guest bathroom a lot um and just be like you know i'll just clean it later or whatever which the guest bathroom doesn't take long at all but i did want to go ahead and clean this first rather than my bathroom because i am about to be in this bathroom a lot 
uh, tomorrow because, you know, I got to do hair, makeup, all of that jazz, record stuff, and, you know, hoop de boop So, we're going to go ahead and kind of get into a deep clean in here. Um, and we're not even going to talk about the closet in here because, hmm, who did this? Like, <laughs> who did this? Girl, it's not that bad, but these are my 30K balloons, okay. This is the little bathroom tray that goes in the tub. And then this pink thing, y'all know, I replaced it with the little black cushion. So I do need to put that on Facebook Marketplace. Probably set this for like $10, $10-$15. And it just needs to tidy up a little bit. I was gonna put this back on my bed. I may go ahead and do that just to get it out of here. And honestly, that's really all. These are my other curtains that I have. That's just like the ones in my bedroom. I mean, in my uh, living room. And yeah, well, we're gonna worry about this a little bit later. But right now, I do wanna actually get into cleaning the countertops, just cleaning everything in this bathroom. Sometimes we laugh and sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now, baby. I took a half and she took the whole thing. Slow down, baby. We took a trip, now we on your blood, and it's like a ghost town, baby. Where did these niggas be at when they said they doing all this and all that? Tired of beefing you punks, you can't even pay me enough to react. Been waking up in the crib, but sometimes I don't even know where I'm at. Please don't pay that nigga songs in this party, I can't even listen to that. Anytime that I run into somebody, it must be a victory lap, hey. Shotty come sit on my lap, hey. They saying Tracy just snap. This in between us, it's not like a store, this isn't a closable gap, hey. I see some niggas attack, and don't end up making it back. I know that they had the crib going crazy down bad, what they had didn't last that bad. Hard to make, so I bet they on their face right now. When he tell the story, that's not how I went. Know they be lying a hundred percent. Moved out of the wrist and forgot about that bit. Why they just call me to tell me, come get it. Now that boy off, and I don't want no credit. If it was me, they wouldn't regret it. Let me be dead, and now they want that. Party still pity, my niggas still eat it. Back out a little, let the garden eat it. Little talk, let him spill in the tea. And then Shroddy came back and said she didn't mean it. It's hard to believe it. I know that they had the crib gone crazy down there. What they had didn't last. Down there, what they had didn't last. Damn, baby. Down there, what they had didn't last. So, update. Just got done cleaning. Tired as hell. Why? <laughs> Y'all already know when I be good and ready to lay down, my job be texting me. He said, hey Akira, this is blank at blank. We are needing help tonight for a sitter on blank. Would you be able to help us for part of a shift tonight? You know what, I was gonna pick up tonight originally anyway. And if I gotta sit, that's cool. I'm gonna take my iPad. I'll probably work on my ebook tonight. Um, it's Thursday, but the only thing is, since I'm, I'm going to be getting off, he said half a shift or part of shift. So I don't really know what that means. I don't know if I'm going to be like leaving. I, I don't know. Maybe he mean like since it's already about to be nine o'clock. I don't know, whatever. But um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go because yeah, I'm not in overtime yet, but I do need, you know, a little extra day or whatever. And especially since I'm not going to be able to pick up it all next week because, I mean, baby birthday and then we're going to be going out the day after his birthday and then, you know, Valentine's Day. Anyways, so I'm going to go ahead and tell him yes today. Um, 
I am really tired, so I'm probably gonna have to stop and give me an energy drink because, girl, I don't need to be sleeping there with that patient. But that's good. Um, it gives me time to kind of organize my life. Um, when I'm at work, I actually really do a really good job at budgeting stuff, like doing my um, monthly budgets, as well as I um, just write out like my meal plans. I literally just get my life together at work because I don't know. When I'm at work, it motivates me to be like. I know this ain't what I want to do for the rest of my life. So when I'm at work, girl, I be on top of it. Like I be making all kind of lists. <laughs> I done did my content schedule. So like all of that. So tonight I'll probably take like my iPad or whatever to work. Um, they asked for a sitter on my actual like home floor. So it's cool. I'll, I'll go. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take some back. Um, I showered this morning and we only went a few places. So I'll probably just shower when I get off in the morning. But that is going to be, that's going to mean that I'm not going to be able to record tomorrow. I plan to get up early, go to the gym, all that woo de woo. So I probably, I don't know, I may wake up and come back and record. But tomorrow's Friday, so I'll be ending this vlog as well, either Friday night or Saturday. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take some back to let him know. But <sighs> I'm going to go help him because I need some moolah. Okay. <laughs> Well, I guess I'm about to go ahead and get ready for work. Oh, my waist trainer girl has been on since 11 o'clock this morning. Like I said, I'm about to go ahead and take it off because, yeah. Um, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So it's been off for nine and a half hours. So we're just going to go ahead and take her off. And I'm going to go ahead and get dressed for work and work on my YouTube ebook for y'all. Ooh, the... The instant relief <laughs> I feel. Woo, girl. It's my first time really wearing it, like wearing it for hours in a very, very, very long time. So yeah, I can't wait to consistently use it and see the results from it. Cause you know, we still got a little pudge right now. All right, <sighs> All right well, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow when I get off work. Cause I'm about to go to work. <laughs> yeah, I'm back home. It is 5.50 in the morning. I left early. I was gonna leave at like four o'clock because girl, I could not stay up. Like they had gave my patient some medicine or whatever and it knocked him out after a good two hours of fighting with him. Like <laughs> trying to hit me and everything. But literally patient went to sleep at like 11.30 midnight and still sleep like as I was walking out still snore everything so I just left the nurse was like she was gonna try to get labs on them and like just whatever I'm like I'm about to go <laughs> he said come in for part of my shift or half a shift whatever I did I did my 80% I'm gone I'm done especially when a patient sleep for six hours like y'all didn't even need me but easy money cool cool whoop -de whoop i was completely tired my battery's about to die but i'm about to go ahead and just take prince out cook me a quick little breakfast and then i'm gonna go to bed i don't even know how my hair look right now i just put it up but yeah i'm about to wrap my hair and go to bed because i'm tired um me and Bay woke up a little bit early yesterday like we was up on and off from like seven to like nine o'clock. So I mean, it's literally six o'clock. So I'm almost up for about 24 hours staying there. So I'm tired as hell. So I went ahead and just left because yeah, I'm tired. Whew. And I know they better not ask me to come no more. Like, no, I'm not coming. <laughs> I can't come in, don't ask me. I'm busy, don't ask me. So yeah, I'm about to take him outside and then I'm gonna come back, cook some breakfast and I'll talk to y'all whenever I wake up today. <laughs> which will probably be about maybe like three o'clock. I'm like tired, but I feel like I may wake up earlier today. I don't know, we're gonna see. I'm just gonna So y'all see that I've been talking about and doing the two week Chloe Ting two week app workout challenge. So I usually just do it at home. If I'm in the gym, I'll just go ahead and do it while I'm at the gym. But I didn't do a proper ending for this video. So I just want to say thank you guys so much for tuning in. And like I keep saying, I'm glad that you guys are enjoying these weekly vlogs, living a long series. Thank you so much 
for tuning in don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe we are getting close to 40k then 50k and y'all know the ultimate goal is 100k aj family members so this workout definitely killed me the first like two to three days um now i think this was what i said like day seven so it wasn't too bad but girl i don't work upper body i work lower body so it was still a little challenge for me so i'm actually about to do my workout right now it is 10 22 the time i'm doing this voiceover so yeah don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe and i will see you lovelies in my next one bye guys Speaking about you, leave it alone. Hope you're grinning while you.